Hi, this is Ben from EnglishDogma.com. I'm in Barcelona. I'm going to tell you today about the difference between what you see and what is actually there in the world. When we look at anything, we generalize, we highlight what's important to us, and we ignore what isn't. This is the process of the mind. There's so much information coming in through our senses, the majority of which is through our eyes, that we have to do this process. We have a thing called the reticular activating system that does it for us. Now, this is fine for normal life, you know, if you had to take in and understand the process, the sheer amount of information available and that's uh, bombarding us all of the time, then it would be too much. But when we do photography, we really want to stop and allow ourselves to open up to this information, to become vulnerable to being inundated, and to really see what we would normally ignore. This process is probably most easily started by just taking half an hour, and it's a long time, but take half an hour and just stay in one, one place for that period of time and don't do anything. Don't check your emails on your phone. Don't phone a friend. Don't have a conversation with anybody. Don't read a book. Just stay still and do nothing for half an hour. In a busy world, it's difficult to do. But what you'll find is that the mind soon gets bored of what it's already seen and starts to identify, starts to look, starts to interest itself and starts to open up to the other things that you might otherwise have missed.